So I'm reading from a section of the book called Notes on the Derangement of Time Now. I used to be the could you, then I couldn't. We laid them all off in writing, one at a time, the stars formed from the cloud of dust rent by trucks crossing the Libyan desert. You see, we didn't have to bomb every country. Some bombed themselves. We just gave them grants, debt, and time to think. But this is a poem, you said, and I fail to see the social relevance. I need the funds to buy sheep, herd them to liquor barrels, calm the nerves a little get back to the computer right by master peace could have ensued, but like we said, it was bombs and you couldn't even get a little nutrition from licking the spent casings, though my sheep will certainly try to do this, battery-like, and really it's a memoir of my time hurting the unhurtable. I'm not sure there's a keyword we can count on here. We want one demonizes some group we've determined to be expendable, some bordered space we can keep closed. Didn't I say the sheep were woven into the very fabric of my art? They are mobile and will not stop until you are in deep sleep of lavender fields. Pull the covers of the book closer. You will be warm enough in the coming nuclear winter to spy the rugged outline of a new ideology of lost hope its lanceolate foliage my sheep have already eaten, which is, of course, my main contribution to society. Weren't this supposed to be a research grant? Told myself this weeping, or maybe was laughing, hard to tell, leaky night boat to nowhere, catching a good wind. Oh, thanks, friendly weather. Cool those jets and stop that heat. So to get back to the work of this danse macabre, list subject matter to be covered, methodology employed, etc. Time runs through our fingers. No, that's water, I said. Maybe grains of sand, cool to the touch, hard to tell differences, shabby aftershocks, the way you sometimes see lightning in an ash plume rising over a volcano erupting and think, really? Lightning too? Not trying to be bleak, really. Method is not trying to be anything, really and certainly not bleak or just need funds to hold up in and forget maybe is just darker sometimes. There just is lightning in an ash plume rising, reminding you the task is to become minor. Refuse standard measure, herd sheep and write poems to stars at night. There's bigger fish to fry anyway, so that's my methodology. Any questions? Everything gets abandoned. A plan is vapor we breathe to dissolve. Often better left undone. The receding light, the quality of silence. Night, tomorrow upon waking. Say that I am recycling. Say I am making nothing out of nothing. Say I am at a border. I can cross, others can't. Have we a tense for this? The limping to come the lyrics last license, the inner geometry of nature, helical or Fibonaccian, became captured last night, lit up at dawn again. Thought cannot turn anywhere else. It is the very shape of you in glass below a skylark singing as some small part of me came up coyote for the feral pleasure of it, little suburban subwolf. Went through as many of our small woods as I could, the light making for a pale damp stricken world my forgotten body walking across the earth, loosely anarchist in intent, bright band below a low ceiling of deep gray. Stand in the saturated grass, testing the lake with sticks and booted feet. Seems to glow or gathers and reflects all light around it, water rising slowly, seasonally, the next thinner time. I would see myself clearly. Life must undulate, a revolution in white glows, visible through a slight fog, a fierce fucking in the sky, growing dim, recurrent cyclical motions, only later become a door to the future when it begins to spiral, a difference that returns, ship in a bottle spinning, fog, the garments the season wears here, now onto my asylum, a genius, so to speak, for sauntering, without land or home, Great gushing wind, more or less clear view of the straits and islands beyond. I imagine concrete falling on me. Kiss yourself, you will see it's true. Do not hold the hands of statues. I put gloves on my grief 
and go through the mirror. Somewhere among elms, the buds of promise. And you, Eurydice, tufts of grass and weed and vine. Clouds of two tinctures lit above and below. Water and light re-echoing. Better dead than, etc. Heart Eros debt illuminated text color of Hawthorne's letter. We are as if allowed, alloyed. The end of the tunnel, not the end of the tunnel, but inside the tunnel. Realize one small fragment of this, the self living solely through transformation into the other. Missed the peace march yesterday. High shreds of cirrus cloud making thin light. Not against the future per se, but with hedge or paling looms and Luddites, Chiapas too, sans papier, comes down to what things the world is comprised of. Do they have edges, openings? Filled with images of futile resistance. Think the wind as it rends gray from gray. Look back at my teacup trembling. Turn a leaf over in my book, the trees shimmering, an alcove in love with the hidden, to keep track of such acts and repeat them. Later, we circle the yard, noting mosses and mushrooms. How damp the flowers feel to light touch. The dark drizzle of words, nevertheless, shadowing forth a shareable world. Its light lights phosphorus glow. Trees sharp against only just revealed blue. There is room for you here too, turning. Cried the hours of a gleaning round the village green. The rest are parks and electric lighting to gather what all accept no one owns. In his hedges are pulled gates and heralds took away the trees, the blackberries, for instance, or pirates, let there be pirates and blackberries, cold, fresh air, stacked, bright, cumulus clouds. The word originally meant shining, berry, where it is perhaps an opening on the visible, latent as freedom or hope, a riot in its purest form, and therefore most unstable. The crescent moon, the stars turning and turning, if you stay awake long enough, these rocks gouged by glacier, the presence of a better life outside, it has cooled to a molten blue, images of invested passion to constitute encounters. I address newfound time, its erotics, hounded by nesting crows, light encircling dark encircling. I am largely largely repetition and the bright spark so. After the last passage, I give a little edge, find a spine of pain. I, this jointure, this moment, cannot be sure there will be words left. The words we reach for, not up to the task, as the boundary is that there is no boundary. Is train whistle gone, though I couldn't give one decibel lower contempt to system churning out cheap auditory products across shimmering borders, electric and calculating. Take this spanking new troubadours of only economic freedom, only love of new sheen product, love the politics of hopeless causes, resonant at the event horizon, the sea composing lighthouses of unsettling wind and cove and the trains outside time rumbling riots, caught barricades in fine clothes, liberated from broken glass stores or prisons, sky physically abolishing the earth in mute weathers, only a minute away from serious cooling. As with a tangle, you can begin anywhere, each day walking away from the wreck of myself, though downfall was merely endured as didn't things in their living numbers lift us up. Every beating was higher learning, Alas, everything hides us, for your window this far reposes, is strident. Oh, shake him with such opiate furor, his, your fate caught up, and yes, accomplice riverbeds lead us. Oh, objects already well known, which antecedent rebels, whose unsealed solidarity sprang up from the dead, felt lifetimes impatient inside her own inexpressible but lost finitude and filled your lovely praise heart resolved cities where squares ladder that carpet pattern bird of open spaces grown grassy city or field tent barricade traffic cone occupants yellow vast red square mountains no one can hide eritrea at last 
fig tree at Karnak sits spectral, leaning, lamenting the transfigured language of every day I'm shuffling, not warm, forget them, the ardent fulcrum's fuck ton. Look, you guys, our life passes, the chance to build visions, sharks from far above, was so deep and shaken an animal. A human, an animal uncages open praises, mutely, mutely healed, leaps up, even where turn to take leave, multitude of species coextensive. Why heart would hands instead of some door, they too praise things which my blood unspeakably hearts. Someday your inconsolable emptiness will swagger only further, perhaps gently be rich, and prophets unleash double unfolding lament takes off or would fall or too big fail as the gap graphing the few far above the many grows.